this poem is called Dead Writer Flatshare. I share my flat with a thousand dead writers. My place is busy with their ghostly words that haunt my cares and are always there, like Plath in Ted Hughes's late work. I flat share with a thousand dead writers. I can't move for a wit or a bard. Bukowski's in the basement, sifting the detritus, wild in the attic, admiring the stars. I flat share with a thousand dead writers. You might think that that would be fun. Proudhon, for one, should inspire us, but the truth is I get nothing done. Because I flat share with a thousand dead writers, which means I can't hear myself think without hearing Ray Carver's reproach from the ladder or Vonnegut from his science kitchen sink. Yes, I flat share with a thousand dead writers, get Hemingway's blues sometimes. I can't take a shit without heat booting in with another stinking rhyme. I flat share without, with a thousand dead writers, not even the Russians agree. On one pure written form, that's why Nabokov brawls with both Chekhov and Dostoevsky. So why flat share with a thousand dead writers? I could Kerouac off on my own. But I think I'd miss Shakespeare's one-liners. On the bright side, I'm never alone. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah, alright Hunter S, I'll come and watch your gonzo toasty making exhibition. Sorry.